welcome to The Spot, brought to you by The Coastal Courier and Bryan County News. We are your guide to fun events happening in Savannah and the surrounding areas. I'm Pearl Federick and we are standing in beautiful Forsyth Park where there is always a ton of events and lots to do. However, for this weekend, the spot to be is north of I-95 where it will definitely be cooler in cooler. Ever since the marathon came to Savannah, we've just have seen an increase in runners and we know we have beginners that are starting out that want to be in the marathon as well as folks that are needing to log their miles. So this way we offer both the 5K and the 15K. If you've spent any time in the coastal empire, you know the phrase cooler in pooler. And the fourth annual cooler in pooler 5K 15K resolution run is making that a reality. And also it's a beautiful course. Some of the 15Ks in the areas we've had runners say they feel like they're running the same thing over and over again. So this gives them a different option. The race starts Saturday, January 10th at 8.30 a.m. at West Chatham Middle School in Pooler and you can register online at savannahraces.com or up until 7.45 a.m. the day of the race. And there is a $5 military discount. And even if this is the first of many runs for you, you will not be alone. We have people of all ages. We have families. We have people that are serious runners that travel like from California, New York to run for this event. So it's really just a total mixed, diverse group of people. And you won't just have fun at the Cooler and Pooler 5K 15K resolution run. All proceeds are going to the Ronald McDonald House. Robert Lewis and Stevenson's book, Treasure Island, mentioned which local building. We'll let you know after the break. Do you know which local spot is mentioned in the book, Treasure Island, by Robert Lewis Stevenson? It's the Pirate House. Welcome back to the spot. If you want to pick up a little bit of art of all different mediums and types, well, head to Art Rise Savannah on DeSoto Avenue for the first Friday Art March. This event takes you through different types of art appreciation from galleries and boutiques to restaurants. Check out www.artrisesavannah.com or call 907-299-6227 for more information. Russia is known for its ballet prowess and the State Ballet Theater of Russia is coming to Savannah. Johnny Mercer Theater is hosting the ballet on Saturday, January 10th as they perform the classic Swan Lake. It starts at 7.30 and you can get your tickets by going to savannacivic.com forward slash events forward slash swan dash lake. And if you want to listen to a little different kind of live music, Locos in Statesboro has it. They are featuring live music Friday and Saturday night starting at 9 p.m. Check out their Facebook page for more information. And if you're looking for a night out on the town, head to Johnny Harris Restaurant for their Terrapin Beer Dinner. It's taking place on Thursday, January 15th at 6 p.m. Now Johnny Harris Restaurant is located on East Victory Drive and $50 gets you a five course beer and food pairing. Call 912-354-7810 for more information. And we wanna know what your favorite spot is? Show us on Instagram, hashtag SAVSpot, or let me know on Twitter at CCPFederic. Do you know which spot this is? We'll let you know after the break. When you open up the Coastal Courier, you get all the news. The good news, the bad news, and coverage of the most current events happening right here in Liberty and Long County. Welcome back. Were you able to guess the spot? It's the Butterfly Garden here in Forsyth Park. And that's all for this week's edition of The Spot, your guide to events happening in Savannah and surrounding areas. We look forward to seeing you next week right here on Spot. <laughs>